What you doing? Paint day. Yay! Really, I'm. I am shaking. I guess I'm nervous. You are I nervous. Am nervous. <laughs> You've been procrastinating all morning. Yeah. It's been a while since I've painted. The worst that could happen is that you mess it all up. You sand it and start all over again. <laughs> that is why the public isn't going to see it until after I've sprayed it. <laughs> I'm sure it will be fine. So, stay tuned.
All right, guys, so uh, I guess the secret's out now. Um, we got it painted. Well, we painted it today, and I'm beyond happy with how it turned out. So for this booth, it worked out really good. I had like one little speck of trash in it over there, which I'm, <laughs> I'm happy with that. You know, it's just fine. It, it laid out good. The paint has got a nice shine to it and i'm just happy i just honestly guys i couldn't um uh, i didn't really want a whole lot of audience at that time and i really didn't want Joni in here because i was nervous because it's been it's been a few years since i sprayed and you know there's nothing like making a fool of yourself on all over the country or wherever so to you tens of people that watch me <laughs> <laughs> all right so i can't take all the credit uh, the gun I used, I bought from Kim's Pro Colors, and it's a SADA 1500. So anyways, uh, I knew I was gonna, I needed a good gun, and I talked with Ken about it over there, and he, he was telling me, he said, you know, SADA was the way to go, and the 1500 won't break the bank. It, was, it wasn't cheap, this was uh, $500. But, uh, it was what? <laughs> my bad. Well, it was fifty-three dollars and mm -hmm. five hundred dollars <laughs> for real. Uh, but uh, it's it's a well-made gun, German-made, and it sprayed so good. Uh, I had my air pressure about twenty-eight psi, and and it just I, it was such a pretty pattern, such a pretty fan. And, uh, and you can look at the paint and tell that it's it just laid down so good. So I don't even know if I'm gonna color sand it. It's, um, we'll see what it looks like out in the sun because these fluorescent lights are about as unforgiving as you're gonna ever find. And, and it's just got a little bit of texture to it, but it's, it's not bad at all. But super happy with that. I got three, um, three heavy coats on it. The first coat, I went a little bit light and the next two coats were real good and heavy. And I thought I was pressing my luck. <laughs> I told you after the third coat, I'm like, okay, I'm done. So I'm happy with it. So what we were shooting today was a Nason uh, full thing, 2K urethane. It's a single stage paint and it turned out really nice. So we're just gonna show you a few areas on it. So this is how well the Sim Rocket Liner matched up with the Nason 2K that we sprayed today. It's, uh, I can't tell any difference. And these are our B pillars and the rockers. You guys remember I sprayed the top of my rocker with uh, the Sim Rocket Liner. And then the A pillar. It's, I'm so glad this is done. And of course across the front where the windshield, or the windshield and the hood lay. You can tell we've got a little dust up here, but they haven't cleaned it. But uh, I promise that we'll show more as we're doing the other pieces. I just, uh, with a new gun, the booth, everything, I really wanted to see how everything was gonna work and work together before I show you guys what I'm doing and look like an idiot, which I still might. But. <laughs> <laughs> as you guys might've noticed during the clip that we were showing with while we were painting, um, the Tyvek suits aren't one size fits all. <laughs> First thing I did, I came in here and squatted down on the on this side to spray the rocker and it it split right across the back. And my shoes wouldn't go in the, the feet part of it, so as the floor got sticky it started tearing it apart. So by the third coat it was actually coming off my body. <laughs> so I was just about to be in here shorts and a t-shirt because it was just pulling itself off. And he um, told me he was going to take really good care of it so he could use it again. Well, that was and the, I laughed when he told me that. And then after I saw the video, I'm like, hey, yeah. <laughs> that, that was the plan, but it, it didn't make it through one paint, one painting. 
It's, uh, uh, I'll have to maybe go barefooted in the suit next time because the little booties wouldn't, or they'll cut the, the boots off. That'd have made better sense, probably. <laughs> Anyways, um, this is done. And so now we can move on and start really tackling all the other pieces and we'll start getting everything else painted and get this thing put together. So thank you guys for um, following us on this journey and putting up with us. Uh, kind of taking a little break here. Uh, I'm re-energized. I'm ready to go. So we'll see you guys on the next one. Y'all you know, please subscribe if you haven't. And uh, hopefully we'll have some more fun stuff to show you. So uh, you guys take care. Bye.